And then let's try and just like... I don't know, I mean... Oh, no! Hey, what's up, guys? This is Tom from Chalk5, back playing Ark Aberration. This is episode 5, I believe. That's crazy. We're coming on really strong, really fast. And as you can see, I have done a bit of... Uh, bit of expanding of the base over here, bit of expansion, and yeah, I haven't really done much else to be honest, um, but I did, this did take a little while collecting all the wood and thatch from all those trees over there. Um, I have some news, and it's some sad news that whilst I was off camera, you you might have just seen how this is like damaged, right here, these, these few pieces, off camera, that Ravager from like the last episode was still down there like in between the I think he was actually here he was like in between these rocks and uh, like I don't know I don't <laughs> I don't know if he was like trapped in the rocks or whatever but anyway he was there and when I saw him he like jumped out at me and attacked me that was fine like I killed him he did a bit of damage to the structure and that but everything was fine however as you can see we've only got one bulb dog now and this is the female one, the green one. And what happened off camera is I went over here for whatever reason, I can't remember. I think I was like trying to tame the parasaurs. Oh, no, no, what was I doing? I can't remember. No, he did that last episode. And anyway, another Ravager was over there and it attacked me, killed me. It was like a level 15. And obviously my bulldog, bull dog was left over there like defenseless. So it died, obviously, as you could probably tell. And, yeah, I had to, like, lure it over here, the Ravager, because I kept dying every time I, like, went over there. There's another death spawn from, like, a way back. I found some of my other bags, the one that was, like, over there. I found that and, like, got rid of it, and it must do this thing where, like, it does them in order of, like, your death points. So, there's clearly a death point over there somewhere. But, anyway, I lured the, uh, the Ravager over here. After it was like attacking that Dodicarus over there, and I loaded it towards the Stego because I thought it was the level 35. It's actually the level 26 male, but luckily he killed it. So <laughs> I didn't actually get the kill, but this cool looking purple spike fellow, he got the kill. And uh, look at them spikes, man, they look mint. And he was pretty bloody, like, he must have done some insane damage to him because he was almost dead. Um, one other thing, as you can see, obviously, is I put the Parasaur Saddle, I made it, because I leveled up, and I put the Ark Survival of Old Skin on it, whatever it is. So, that's pretty cool. Unfortunate that we lost our little friend there, but, oh well, he, you know, these things happen. So, if any of you guys, like, left names or anything, I haven't really uploaded quite many, well, I think I'm only on, like, episode 2 that's online at the minute, so... Obviously, I haven't seen any names yet. If you guys have, by the way, do me a favour. Get involved and, like, leave some names for, this, for like, dinos and stuff like that. Either on this, uh, these series or my other series on the island. Just Vanilla Ark. Get involved, guys. It'd be sweet to, like, hear from you. And feel free to, like, click that I in the top right-hand corner if you want to watch any more of my other Ark series. Also, I've got a favour to ask. If you guys are watching this... In which case, thank you. Um, what other, like, series on YouTube, like, do you enjoy watching? What would you like to, like, see more of? Because right now I'm currently, like, just doing arc, like, this arc and normal arc. What is that over there? Oh, it's a scorpion. It's a scorpion level 15 female. That's not bad, actually. Hmm. Dodo Chris level 13 male. We may might be able to tame that. I might just leave this here and then we could like go see about that. Maybe. Uh, so yeah, I think now, what level am I? I'm not sure if I unlocked uh, not that, tranquilizer arrows or not. I think one thing I do need to tell you guys is we have unlocked the refining forge. So we need to get on that and do that right away. I'm going to unlock the tranquilizer arrow as well, but we need to unlock the smithy and the metal tools next. That's going to be awesome. That's really going to like improve things. Um, before I lose my trailer thought, though, yeah, if any of you guys are watching anything that you want to watch more of and maybe you'd like to see me play it, then feel free to like leave a comment down below and let me know what you think would be a good playthrough series. And like, bear in mind, I've only got a PlayStation 4. I would love if I had like... 
like a gaming computer and I could like play some amazing games with some amazing mods and stuff like that but I just don't have it so that's unfortunate but you know if there's anything on PlayStation chances are it probably is I mean <laughs> that's how games are these days then I can play it but I do like the survival sort of games so if it was anything like that I'd definitely be up for it uh, right that scorpion's over there we could probably get this let's make the weapons ammo let's make a load of them like you saw, I've got a few narcotics. I was going to try and get more berries, actually, with this uh, parasol, because this is awesome now that I can... I did get a load of berries there. That's what that bag is, in case you're wondering. But I can use these mushrooms for when we knock it out. Probably won't need many, but I can just hold on to them. These are like narcotic mushrooms. Highly narcotic mushrooms. So that's pretty good. And we've got some metal in there already, so we should be able to like make a refining forge here in a second. We'll get on that... In a bit. In fact, I'll leave you here. And I'm just thinking, if I could, like, climb on a rock again. I did see some raptors, like, way over there. That, I don't know, we might be able to, like, look at taming here soon. I don't know, maybe. We could, like, venture out. Now we've got, like, tranquilizer arrows and stuff. Maybe that would be a good thing to do. Let's try and get this scorpion. Wherever it is. Mm, this isn't really the best vantage point, but we can try. Oh, got a hit right there. Nice. And remember last time, the level 1 scorpion only took, like, one hit. No, he's... Oh, okay, he's going to die. Man, he's going to get killed by the stego. I would have thought, well, that was a stego. Oh, jeez. Oh, God. No, 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 no. Passive. Oh, God. Okay. Neutral. Okay. What level is this stego? Oh, oh yeah, that, that scorpion's dead, hater. Oh, unless he knocks it out. That would be insane. Let's just watch this, like, battle here for a second. I wonder if we should, like... I wonder if we should, like, join in? Should we join in? Should we, like, hit this Stego and, like, knock it out? That would be an insane team. Mate, if we can get both of them. And then... Oh, he's killing that Stego. Oh, my God. I was hitting it in the head. Let's just like, let's, oh, let's top all this out. Let's top all this out. Okay, that's out. That's out. Can I knock you out? That would be amazing, guys. Oh, I'm out of, uh, oh. I'm out of stones. No, come back. Come back. Ow. Okay, ow. That hurt. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, he's coming back now. Now he's mad. Now he's mad. Can we get away somewhere? Oh, God. Oh, God. I don't know how fast he is. <laughs> Woo. Woo. I don't know if we're okay. Are we okay? Maybe. I'm going to try and get some stone and we're going to try and hit this bad boy. We've knocked out the scorpion. That's good. Oh, jeez. No, oh, don't hit me. Don't hit me. Okay, well, if he kills me, that's no big deal, but... Mm. Hang on, wait. I was going to say, if a parasol's not running after him, is he? Please don't tell me he is. I am nearly dead now. <laughs> he just nearly killed me with, like, one hit then. That's crazy. Ah. Uh, are you kidding me? Is he killing my scorpion? No. No, he killed it. He killed it. Oh, man, what a savage. What a savage. He wasn't done with me. He wanted to kill my tame as well. Man. If we can get the stegger, though, I will actually freak out. I'm not too bothered about that scorpion there. Shame that he just went back to it and killed it, but whatever. And now my... Oh, he's running away! He's running away! Why am I so slow? Oh, there we go. Right. Uh, go, 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 go! Guys, this would be insane. I just hope that, like, I don't know, that gas vein doesn't kill us or these stegos don't go ape and, like, try and kill us. Oh, my God, he's coming back. He's coming back! He's coming back! Run! Oh, my God! Sorry if I'm, like, blowing out my microphone. I'll try and, like, step back when I'm going crazy. <laughs> Oh, God. What's happening? Let's get up on this rock. Nice. Nice. This is great. This is great. He's got to be about knocked out, surely. I mean, he's pretty bloody. If we kill him, also not too bad, because it's like, you know, whatever. Oh, jeez. Oh, oh, when I died. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, man. Maybe we should wait then. Maybe we should wait till we get some, um, some more trank arrows. 
Ah, man. Respawn at bed. Okay, damn. <laughs> we went flying, man. <laughs> like, knocked us off the cliff. Let's just, uh, oh, at least the bulb dog's fine. Nice. Where's my dead body? Here it is. <laughs> oh, jeez. What is going on there? That looks nasty as heck. And I, I still like, have my armor on that. <laughs> what? Oh, let's get rid of this nasty ass body. Nasty. All right, where is that stego? Like, I, I really want it. <laughs> It'd be so good to get a stego like that. Level 45. Are you kidding me? Man, I wish we could see how much torpor it had. Hmm. Hmm. You know I'm eyeing you up, Stego. I'm eyeing you up, Hater. Nah, let's wait. Let's wait. Um, in fact, now that Scorpion's unfortunately dead. Hmm. Yeah. Hmm. Unfortunate. Never mind. Let's harvest the flesh. Don't mind if I do, Hater. Okay. We could just, like, ride around on you for a bit. Man, I need to, like, fix all my armor. It's hardly armor. It's just cloth. But whatever. I guess... Do I have... Hide armor unlocked? In fact, I'm just going to get rid of this trash, by the way. Um, nope. Oops. Put all my clothes back on. And armor. Yeah, we have hide armor. Do we have any hide, though? I don't know. I, I'm surprised I don't, like, have... What is that? Respawn cooldown. Oh, okay. Hmm. No, I think I, like, used all my hide and stuff. Ooh, we need to sort of go kill some stuff. Maybe what I'll do, put this meat on the fire. And put up, like, some of my other stuff, maybe. Put up, like, this. And, uh, we've got a bit of hide, but it's honestly, like, nothing. We've got a spare axe for whatever reason. Don't even know. Don't even care. Throw that out. And let's put the spoiled meat up here. Yes, we got 35. Oh, we did have more nook. Oh, man, are you kidding me? Hmm. I didn't see that. Right. So. What are we better off doing? Trying to knock out that... That stego? Or... Hmm, man, I don't know. Or trying to, like, go get a raptor. Man, I don't know what, like, what's, like, the best idea. Can we fix this as well now? Now that I've shown you that what's happened. <laughs> uh, where's the repair? Uh, lay on bed. What? No, I don't want to do that. Uh, yeah, there is. Uh, 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 my, no. Can I? There we go. There we go. There we go. Nice. I don't think any of these are damaged because I, I made these, like, afterwards. The Ravenger stuff, like, happened straight away, because I was like, I was going to come on and be like, oh, at least I can have, like, a chilled out, just build my base and stuff, and then, nope, two Ravenger attacks. It was crazy, but I actually handled it pretty well, which doesn't normally go to plan on here. I think that's more when I'm recording videos for you guys, and then it all goes to pot. Okay, another Scorpion, what? <laughs> I wonder what he was running away from then. Hmm. What is going on? Let's just see. Right, he's getting a good attack on it. If it's a high level scorpion, which it. Nah, level 22. They're getting better. They're getting like higher levels. Nah, I'm just scared he's going to wreck it, though. I don't know what to do. I would love to tame that Stego, like I keep saying, but. Let's just try and get some more knocker berries. We can make loads of arrows, and then we can just do whatever. Like, whatever we want, then. Just need to be careful that scorpion doesn't. Like, come over to us, then. Also, if it knocks that stego out, I am absolutely killing it. But, no, it looks like he might have killed the scorpion. Come on. That's the one thing, like, the parasol. It sucks for getting berries in a way. Like, it's really good, but... It sucks how, like... You have to literally get his face, like, right in the middle of the bush. Look, see, like, that didn't even do it. That was, sucks. Whereas, like, a trike and... Bronto and all stuff like that. Like, you can just hit it from, like, a mile away. It doesn't even matter. Well, not a mile, but you know what I mean. <laughs> See, whereas this one, like, it's literally one bush at a time. 
trikes and that they do like quite a few stegos do loads that's why i love a stego that'd be amazing tame oh there's that scorpion <laughs> gross we just like hit it uh have you got anything in your inventory oh my god a metal pick are you kidding me and a one a pike oh man that's awesome uh don't really need the berries don't really need the spear wow you guys that's insane uh let's just get rid of that absolute trash that is the stone axe and oh my god a pike as well that's that's awesome right let's replace the water bottle with i guess we can get rid of the slingshot now because like you know yeah it doesn't really matter now does it no, no. If we we're getting like trank arrows, and I can make like loads of tranquilizers off camera. Oh, and I didn't harvest the flesh. Whoops. Let's do it with the new pickaxe. Wow, not bad. I only got one hit on it, but got five meat from it. That's crazy that we just found a metal pick. We haven't even got a smithy yet. Nice. I mean, we could potentially have a a metal pick by now, but we don't. So <laughs> I'm loving it. In fact, how much flint are we gonna get with this bad boy? Uh, not like vast amounts uh, different. I mean, that's not like the biggest rock, I guess, in the world, but... Uh, we're getting a meh, meh, decent amount. Not going to complain. Not really too impressed either, but... Well, that was a massive rock. We got a lot of stone from it for whatever reason. And uh, let's get a load of flint, and then we can like make loads more arrows. That's awesome. Okay, cool. So, let's give you a level up as well. Only level 8 now, after this level up. Hmm, I'm tempted to do, like, more health still, because at this stage, it could... He could die, like, so easily. And I mean, like, so easily. Uh, get rid of, like, some of these... I don't really know what's with these, like, light mushrooms yet. And I guess keep these. Probably, like, if we see another, um... Another bulb dog. Way Cinnamon sticks! Um, then we can... Oh, more cinnamon sticks! Then we can, uh, tame, <laughs> tame it. And even more cinnamon sticks. Are you kidding me? There we go. Oh, and crystal. I'm not going to say no to all these free loot that's been thrown up out of the ground, even though I am overweight now. Ooh, blue, green, obsidian... And, oh, more obsidian just rolling down, rolling my way. Oh, it's like they're throwing it at me in my face. And now I'm over and coming. <laughs> what can I make to ammo, miscellaneous? Oh, I could yeah, I should make a load of them. Why not? Why not, right? Saddles, no. Structures. Was I, like, making any more of these? I can't remember. Storage. Oh, I unlocked the large storage bin. And I can't remember, did I? Yeah, I unlocked the, um, the, that thing. <laughs> Preserving bin as well. I, man, I still can't move. Get over here. Parasol. Get over here. Uh, how do I do that? Yeah, there. Get here, right now, please. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Get there. Yeah, there we go. No, <laughs> I couldn't reach him before. Okay, so I can give you, like, all the heavy stuff. And do I miss that other stuff now? Yeah, I think it's gone. It doesn't last very long, like after an earthquake. And man, I'm still really heavy. I've got oh, I've got loads of them water mushroom things, aquatic mushrooms on me. Might as well just give you some of them. What else have I got on me? I've got some stone, I've got some wood. Uh not not like a much else. Why are they so heavy? I don't know, they must have been them... Oh, because I've got, like, the pike in that as well now, haven't I? Like, that's gonna... That weighs, like, 12 or something, I think. Something crazy. So, I'd like to keep, like, some of these rocks here, just because we can use them for, like, taming things. But... Is this meat cooked now? Nearly. Could put some more meat on as well, in fact. Alright, cool. So, we got, like, 90... Yeah, I've got 90 berries there. We can make... Quite a few. How many? 18... And I guess put up like the extra stone in here. And uh yeah, it's not really oh yeah, I can put this that up, make some spark powder. And I guess I can put that chitin up 
probably put it in here because I've got the other stuff in here as well. So yeah, we got some metal and stuff. Um, got loads of like obsidian gems now. That's pretty good, honestly. Pretty good. It's night time, so we need to watch the heck out. There are some like baddies at night time. Um, by the way, speaking of night time, look at the bottom left hand corner. Uh, bottom left, bottom right hand corner. It says you're within the effect of a charge radius protection you from the nameless protecting you from the nameless what on earth is the nameless like I think I've seen like a picture of them like you know on the opening screen for like when you load arc if it's on, if you're on PlayStation 4 I don't know if it applies on uh, on just like regular I guess PC version or whatever but yeah so there's like these like creature things but I don't know if they're like in caves or do they come out at night? Do they come out like after earthquakes or something? I have no idea. And I'm not even sure I want to find out, to be quite honest. <laughs> but we probably will at some point. And it'll probably like creep me out. So let's just keep going. I've been blabbing on for a lot this episode. We're already like 23 minutes in or something. Something crazy. So, yeah, we've got some more glow sticks now. That's good. And you've got loads of water things on you. See, now we could go have a look for raptors, but with it being night time, I don't really want to right now. <laughs> I guess we can make some more, like, narcotics and stuff like that. And then... I don't know. Do you guys want to, like, try one of these stegos? I don't know what to do. We haven't really got a good vantage point. That's my only, like, worry. Because you saw how he, or she, scaled that rock and hit me off. Which ultimately killed me. But, ah, <laughs> uh, we could try. Also, the green things over there, they are crystals and they just give you regular crystals. But I also think they give you, like, gems and stuff. So, if we ever did need to harvest casual gems and stuff, then we could do that here. No problem. Yeah, I'm sort of like, I'm stuck as what to do now. Might leave my parasol here. And go look for like a bulb dog. And maybe go look for like some dodos to kill, possibly tame. Take them with me. And we can use these narcoberries just to like start making more narcotics. Let's just quickly do that. And yeah... I might just go have a look for some, so let's be really careful, because I don't... Like, obviously I can't see... Oh yeah, we can do this, can't we? Nice! And I've got a glow stick on me. Oh, that means, in fact, I can leave my bulb dog here, can't I? Which might be a good idea, because then I can pick the other one. Yeah, let's do that. Okay, stay here, bulb dog. You're in charge. In fact, let's give you a level up. Let's give you a... Uh, man, if I can get this thing right. Let's give you, like, some more charge capacity. Just so you're like, because, I don't know, I'd like to get a higher level one, and then we can keep this one here. And if the charge capacity is really high, she can be, like, our torch at the base. You know, and basically just live there and light the place up. So, that's what we can do. We can also, like, throw these glow sticks, if you guys aren't familiar with them. Or, like, my other episodes where I like, made these, they're so easy to make, it's just crystals and gems and we just need to be really careful because there was a this is obviously where that other ravager was but now it's dead so we shouldn't have to worry but there was a sarco over there before uh, Parasaur Ethereum there and Dodicarus there obviously there's a uh, Diplodocus there or Diplodocus, oh there's a scorpion there there's a scorpion there, okay Alright, we, we're still on trunk arrows. What level is it? What level is it? And level 8 female. Now that's not too bad. That is not too bad. If I could just quickly get up here, maybe. Oh! Oh, I wasn't doing it for a second. Uh, yeah, we really need to make like a water jar soon as well. I think that should unlock relatively soon. Let's just see if we can get this guy. Because, girl, whatever. It'd be cool to have a scorpion again. Oh, are you kidding me? Oh, oh, I didn't make that. Nice. 
Right, we need to be really careful because I do not want to waste these arrows. So, um... Why is he running after? He keeps, like, running after something. Let's be really, really careful. I don't know what else is, like, out here. And I haven't really gone that far, in all honesty. So, let's shoot that again. Oh, we got him! We got him! We got him! Is he coming back? Is he coming back? I don't know. I don't know what's happening. What is happening right now? Ah, uh, some dodos over there. That's good. That's good. Let's see if we can actually get this guy. What is it doing? There we go. What is happening? Like, what? What is going on with like the AI? If you guys didn't see like that, the last episode, last episode, there was a ravenger that I was just punching. Oh my god, he's down. He's down and out. Ladies and gentlemen, it's down and out. Let's run back to the base, grab some spoiled meat. I wasn't expecting to, like, try and tame a scorpion, casual scorpion like that. Um, yeah, man, I need some water as well. That sucks. That sucks. Well, there's dodos over there. We can come back and kill them. We really need some hide for the... For, oh, actually, we could kill a Diplodocus as well, couldn't we? Yes, we could. Because they do no damage at all. With the scorpion, hopefully, if we get that tamed. Nice and tamed. Then we can use it to kill it. That'd be great. That'd be fantastic. Right now, though, I really need to get this water going. What is going on, trilobite? And, oh, man, I'm tired. It's because uh, your stamina, like, doesn't go back up after you've, uh, after you've lost all your water. Your hydration. So let's just real quick. I'm just going to run back, get the spoil meat, and then I'll meet you guys back at the scorpion in a second. Okay, guys, I'm back. Oh, wow, I've literally just... Oh, my God, that was so quick! Are you kidding me? That was insane. Oh, wow. Okay, level... What is it? Level f 11, female scorpion. That is awesome. Okay, so... Hmm. What do I want to do with you? Wow, your claws are so bright. That's, that's insane how bright they are. Uh, it's turning daytime now, so that's pretty good. I just ran back and grabbed all the spoiled meat because I was like, I don't really care. So yeah, you follow me. I was just wondering, like, what level is this uh, parasaur? What level are you? Level 7 female. Hmm. <laughs> is it worth, like, taming another parasaur? Probably is, honestly, but what is that there? Oh, it's a moss chops. Moss chops. Ah, uh, I'm sort of being really cautious because I've never, like, been over here yet, so... I don't know what to expect, but I did grab the other narcotics, so if we do see anything cool, we've got quite a few trank arrows, and I can make quite a few more. Well, I say quite a few, it's like 13 more. Ah, uh, this is like moss thing hanging down. Hmm, doesn't really look to be much over here. What level is that? Stego? 17 male, that's not too bad. Alright, Scorpion, chill out. That was like right in my ear. Um, Yeah, wow, look at that boss top. It's pretty cool. Female. What do you need? Rare mushrooms. We do have a lot. Yeah, we have a lot of rare mushrooms. Uh, let's just like hit a tree real quick. But one rare mushroom. There we Two rare mushrooms. There we go. Nice. Uh, we could try. I don't know if this will actually like, tame it. Because it's level 7, it... Like I said, I've got my um, taming on really hard. Oh my god, yes! Oh wow, okay, cool. So we've got a female aberrant moss chops. Is female, right? Yeah, female. And, oh, it's already got berries and stuff. Cause it was, did you see it, like, harvesting berries and stuff? That's cool. So we can do this little, like, meme where if I tell them to, like, go there and then tell him not... Yeah, see, look at that. It'll just... Oh my god, it looks like he's doing something else to my scorpion. <laughs> oh, censor that out! So what are you doing? <laughs> but he's not, he's not, guys. Okay, let's stop that. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Follow me, guys. Um, yeah, he actually, like, just co collects berries and stuff on his own. So that's pretty awesome. Oh my god, he collected quite a bit, actually. Nice! And some rare mushrooms, so I guess he can, like, just hold on to the berries and that. Because I think he's a... Herbivore. 
I think. Well, I know because he eats meat and he, oh, he eats all kinds of like random trash. And I'm saying he, I mean she. So yeah, that's pretty cool. That's sort of what I was doing on my other arc series with the Therizinosaur. I was just sort of like saying, hey, go stand by that tree. And then you tell them to stop following you. And they'll just harvest it because like it, they want to do it or whatever. So <laughs> they want to do it. I don't know. I guess they do want to do it. Uh, so we've got an Iguanodon here. Level 7. Female Iguanodon. Hmm. I've never tamed one of these before. Let me just do some quick research and then like see if this is even possible because I don't want to waste the arrows on it. So one second, guys. I'll be here again in a second. <laughs> yeah. Okay, guys. So I just did some quick research and it looks like we can tame it with... Uh, miho berries and vegetables and stuff like that and also like the sweet cake and micro raptor kibble obviously we don't have that passive oh i'm getting shoved out of the way okay tell you guys to like wait here let's just let's just try it out so oh please don't come up here 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 and please don't die <laughs> okay oh oh it's out Nice, that was super quick, super fast. Okay, you've got berries, that's awesome, that's fantastic. And uh, I've only got a few, but I'll take those, and I guess I'll just, yeah, I'll just take them all. Nice, ooh, and i got the, like, knockout, oh, I've already got some in my inventory. But you've got to level up, uh, I'll do that later. <laughs> Let's try and tame an Iguanodon. I have never done this before. I've never tamed an Iguanodon, but they look so badass on Aberration. With that, like, flame pattern on the side. So, I don't know how many of these are going to need. Might be quite a few. I have no idea. Okay, I've put food in inventory. Are these... Wait, I'm just having a look on my... Put food in inventory. Oh, no, it's eating. Oh, no, that's fine. Nice. I was just about to say, I wonder if it's, like, passive or something. You have to tame it. Okay, that's going up pretty fast. That's not bad. And this is going to be... What level is it? Uh, it doesn't even say there, does it? Plus three levels, but what level are you now? Uh, what? I can't even like see it there. Oh, yeah, level seven. So it's, oh, it's only like level ten. Apparently, they're like really good. I think they're like good for like carrying stuff. And... Um, let me just see what it is. So, combat, no, 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 utility. Here we go. It says on the Arc Gamepedia, that's like where I get all the information about these things. But it says so, a low level mount, moderately easy to tame. Just remember to bring a bowler or bear trap. Oh, we didn't even need that. Did not even need that. So, pack mule as well. Stamina does not drain when running on all fours. What? That's insane. Farming aid allows berries to be turned into seeds, making ones to get harder. Uh, making berries, making once hard to get berries much easier. Narco berries also get for making. Oh wow, not bad. And then long distance runner stamina doesn't drain well on all fours and everything. And across island. Oh wow, so this is going to be like a pretty cool tame for like our low level. I mean, what level are we now? We are. Well, level 21. Okay. <laughs> I don't know why I can't see levels and stuff all of a sudden, but whatever. And it's going to be tamed here real quick, guys. So I don't even need to, like, cancel the uh, the recording or anything like that. And that's this is going to be amazing. We've tamed, like, three creatures all in one episode. I'd be pretty pleased if we can get another boob dog as well. Let's just... Oh, there it is! Nice! Leave a comment down below if you want to name the brand new... Badass looking Iguanodon. That looks so good. Level 10 female. She's kind of like green with those like clearly like flame pants. She looks like a dragon. Oh wow. Nice. And same for the scorpion and moss chops that we got over here. And I know you guys will come up with like better names than me. So I'm going to give you some health. Oh my god look at that face. Look at that mouth. Get out of here, charge bug. And so, it'd be really cool if you guys joined in and left some comments and stuff. I'd like it. I'd give you, like, a shout out and that, obviously, so... If... Oh! Oh, I thought it was going to be, like, quicksand. Oh, no! 
Oh no, we can't get back up there, can we? Oh no, why did I jump down here? I mean, we could like build like a ramp or something if we need be, but... Ah, uh, wait. <laughs> you guys wait here. I do not want to lose these. Please don't let me lose them. Why did I go this way? And I can see something over there. What is that? Oh, it's Parasaur, I think. Yeah, Parasaur. Level 3 female trash. Um, oh! Oh! There's a raptor there. Level 5 something. And, oh no! Oh no, guys. How are we going to get back up there? Oh, oh, this is not good. This is not good. And, man. Dun, dun, dun. What are we going to do? I, right, if I can build like a ramp or something, I will totally do that. <laughs> okay, let's try and just do that. Because I do not want to risk my dinos. I mean, I could go round, obviously, but I don't want to do it. So, structures. Um, I guess like build like a... Oh god, earthquake, earthquake, earthquake! <laughs> we could build like thatch foundations and then put like a sloping roof up to it, maybe? Let's do that anyway, let's get some wood. Get some fungi wood. And I guess get some like thatch and stuff like that. This is pretty cool that we're like exploring the rest of the the place over here, but mm, I don't know. I don't, I don't like this at all. I'm not going to bother with like, the gems and stuff because I don't want it to weigh me down. Although I've got like, a, like casual pack meal all over there that I'm not even using, but whatever. So let's try and... If I can unlatch, unlatch, unlock the, the sloped roof, there we go. Can't do them, but hopefully we won't need them. And then let's try and just like... I don't I mean, Oh no! Oh god, I died! Did you see that? I literally... Okay. <laughs> what? Are you kidding me? I jumped! Like, during the earthquake and it just threw me across the... the... Oh my god, are you kidding me? Alright, respawn, run location. No, respawn a bed. What? <laughs> Are you kidding me? That was insane. Right, guys. Well, I'll probably, like, get them back and then just, like, end the episode or something. So... Oh, man. I don't even believe that right now. Right. Leave it with me, guys. And um, we don't have, like, anything either. So I'm going to have to, like, make a pick and all stuff like that. Yeah, leave it with me, guys. I'll run back there, grab my stuff, and I'll see you here again next episode. I hope you've enjoyed this episode, apart from that, like, dramatic end that we just had. Uh, but hopefully all my dinosaurs are still going to be alive and all that, so I'm going to run back there real quick and sort that out. But hopefully you enjoy this, like, cool taming spree that we went on, and that you're not too disappointed about my other bulb dog dying. Um, but anyway, hope to see you again soon, guys. Thanks for watching, and, yeah, peace! Bye-bye.